next. We are back at 749 with the story behind this rather large billboard in Times Square. And we lost the return of the prodigal son. Yeah. Yeah. Where have you it's been? Cute. Dex, there's a little singing show on our network every Monday and Tuesday called The Voice. It's in the live shows. That's I don't want to say you've been gone for a long time, but we have a picture of the last time you were in the orange room. Can we put the picture in this? It's ridiculous. Just that was before I shaved. Yeah, no, it's good to be back, guys. And we're kind of, it's so, so cool, the screen in Times Square. I mean, yeah. it's enormous. Times Square known for its bright lights and big billboards. There's the new billboard, uh, the biggest billboard on the block. Literally, it's an entire city block uh, long. It's crazy. It's, it's the whole facade of the Marriott Marquis there. That's the world's largest billboard. They unveiled it on Tuesday. That's where I do the New Year's Eve show on NBC from, so maybe we can utilize that screen there. But it's fan I mean, just to give you an idea of, of the size, it's 110 yards long, so larger than an American football field. Wow. There, there you guys are in the live shot there. It's eight stories high. 72 million bulbs make up wow. the screen. Uh, obviously, about a half a million people visit Times Square every day, so we get great visibility. And it's, if you're wondering how much you want to buy some advertising, Matt, it's 2.5 million. That gets you a four-week uh, run there. Hey, Carson, if, if one bulb goes out, do they all go out? <laughs> I don't know about that. I do think this might be the, uh, the prototype for the new iPhone 7 Plus. That's how big the screen is there. It's pretty cool. Yeah, it is cool, guys. I know. My teeth are like as big as, like, tennis courts on that thing. Cool. Carson. Thank you. you. Yep. Got it. Coming up, Willie reveals his.